Ringing in Christmas with a bang, the video depicting fireworks in the village of Agate on Christmas Eve went viral. The images surfaced also showing police officers enjoying the show, including former police Colonel Mark Charfris. I have not heard uh, anything or no, no updates. I know that uh, there was an investigation being done. Agate Mayor Kevin Sosiko is aware of the spectacle. Guam Police and the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms Investigations are ongoing. The site is similar to a case reported around the same time in 2016, a case that led to the arrest and termination of Charfris from the force. A mistrial was declared after prosecutors tried to tie him to the local gang Agate Bloodtown. It's a public perception about the village that the mayor hopes to change. We still want to move forward and we still want to promote uh, the positive, uh, of course, vibe for our village. Um, we want. Uh, everyone to know that on Guam that um, our office uh, and our community we, where you foster of course safety and um, we like to keep it as open as possible being our, our uh, motto being the gateway to the south we like to always welcome everyone um, and so as mayor of the village I, I would really like to and someday hope that that um, name of course of the Agate Blood Town will soon fade away and uh, be given and maybe a new title of some sort uh, as you know being the most welcoming um, to the south. Meantime authorities have yet to confirm if they caught a break in the case by narrowing down any leads or suspects. GPD and ATF officials only confirming the case remains under investigation. Reporting for Guam's News Network, Guahusinic Delgado.